Here are 23 idiots in cars. Before we continue, make sure to hit that like button. Also subscribe to our channel and turn on post notifications so you never miss another video. Do it and you will get 10 years of good luck. In our first clip of the video, we have a motorcycle driving down the road just fine before a white truck from another lane crosses, skidding in front of him and into a ditch. It's a miracle that the motorcycle driver wasn't injured. All is well at this intersection until a driver suddenly decides to run a red light, nearly colliding with a truck in the process. What could have caused the driver to suddenly run through this light? As the man filming us tells us, the woman has a movie playing on her dash while she drives on a rainy interstate. Yes, that is a f movie playing on her dash. While this is super stupid and you should never try it, I can at least appreciate her ingenuity. Once this train finishes passing, the car on the left suddenly realizes he's on a two-way road, nearly colliding head-on with incoming traffic, and then almost running into the car on his right. My question is, how long was this guy driving on the wrong side of the road? Here we've got a video of a guy weaving in and out of lanes on a highway. I think all of us have been on the road with this guy before, and I feel like we can all relate when I say he's the worst kind of driver. A motorcycle appears to get stuck on something and begins to tip over, but the driver is able to jump off the bike and avoid any injuries before it falls. I wish I had this guy's reflexes. Here we've got someone not watching where they're going in a car wash. To be fair to the driver, I'm not sure how easy it is to see while going through those. Here we can see a Ferrari trying to gun past another car, only to lose traction in the rain and lose control of his car. There's just something about rain that seems to bring out the worst and most stupid drivers. This truck either has no control of his brakes or just doesn't care and slams into multiple outdoor seating areas. Luckily, everyone was able to move out of the way before this guy could hit them. If anyone can tell what this next driver's goal is, feel free to let me know down in the comments, because I have no idea. He runs through a red light into a busy intersection before drifting into a median and then zooming off. Honestly, I feel like all of the honking is only encouraging this guy. Here we've got a motorcycle driving through what appears to be a flooded street before unfortunately hitting a section that's just a bit too deep. Wherever he was headed to probably doesn't seem like it's worth it now that he's going to have to fish his bike out of the river. Despite traffic cones being both orange and reflective, some people just aren't going to see them. Thankfully, after hitting the cone, this guy quickly realizes his mistake and was able to get into the corrected lane. No harm, no foul. After being stopped by the cops, most likely for reckless driving based off the rest of the clip, this idiot driver decides to make a break for it by doing donuts, smashing into other cars, nearly running people over, and eventually destroying their car. I really don't want to know why they thought any of this was a good idea. This clip is a mess, with one car barely avoiding running straight into the bushes and the other not-so-lucky car slamming straight into them. My favorite part of this whole clip is that after witnessing all of this, the third car just proceeds to politely take his right and go on his way. While going through a roundabout, the driver filming gets clipped by someone driving straight through the lanes. I know roundabouts can be confusing, but they're not that hard to understand, right? This clip is a classic case of someone not realizing or not caring that they don't have the right of way. Luckily, the driver filming was able to break enough that not-so-serious damage was done. Everything is going normally in this clip until the red car decides to do a quick donut to presumably avoid missing his exit. World of advice, be on your guard when driving near exits, because that's when people really tend to pull dumb stunts like this. In this clip, we see this brown truck get a little too close to the curb, taking out several trash cans in the process. What really sucks is you know he didn't stop to clean up all that trash. While presumably trying to pass, this truck nearly causes several wrecks by driving in the wrong lane. If it weren't for all the other drivers paying attention, this could have been real nasty.
Having missed a left lane ending sign, a black car ends up getting wedged between a barrier and a semi, which is probably many drivers' worst nightmares. He swerves to try and save himself, but only ends up throwing himself across several lanes and into another semi, totally smashing up the hood of his car. This is such a good example of why you should pay attention to road signs. I don't even know who's more at fault in this clip. Two cars end up crashing into each other, and in an attempt to make a getaway, they end up locking wheels until the SUV partly crushes the other driver's hood and drives off, leaving the sedan to drive away while literally falling apart. A semi doesn't realize his back was up and accidentally took out an interstate sign, as well as probably totaling the truck. At the very least, good on the people filming for trying to tell him what was going on. Here we have a fantastic example of instant karma. A car tries to show off in front of some motorcycles and speeds off way above the speed limit, right in front of a cop, who promptly pulls him over. Talk about unlucky. Thanks for watching the video. Be sure to give us a thumbs up if you enjoyed it. Also, don't forget to subscribe to never miss our videos. Watch the videos on screen now.